Perfect. Hi, Andrew. Hey, Mark, how are you? And one Very thing good. I was thinking, going back to what Dustin said, is you'll never be able to see what data science does. It always about feeling the data science. That's right. So, uh, Andrew, I'm I'm excited that we get to have this chance to have like a, a dialogue and give uh, folks uh, in this incredible summit. Like we've I've I've learned a lot already, uh, and we'll have this dialogue and and get to shed a little light about how a large company like Northwestern Mutual handles data science and analytics. And so, uh, I want to start by giving you a chance to introduce yourself. Uh, you've had an incredible career earning your PhD in genetics and statistics from the Ohio State, uh, then Enterprise Car Rental, Monsanto, uh, Syng uh, Syngenta, and then with a variety of roles from global analytics and model deployment, tech strategy, partnership, sustainability. And so from your perspective, why Northwestern Mutual? Why FinTech right now for you? Yeah, no, great question. Yes, I have, uh, you know, changed the industry vertical over the years, past two decades, but the data science has always stayed consistent throughout, especially starting out from the degree that I graduated to where I am now with Northwestern Mutual. And the question is why Northwestern Mutual, right? Because there are many other companies out there. Everybody is doing data science now. It just, it's become the DNA by which we survive and we excel as well. So when I think about Northwestern Mutual, especially the FinTech industry, the industry in itself is transforming massively. There's way we did things in the past and that there's way that we are gonna do things in the future. Think about underwriting, right? There's tons of manual underwriting that used to happen before. And now there are processes and things in place or models in place that you can put into production by which you can underwrite automatically. So insurance industry hasn't caught up a whole lot of, um, you know, progression that has been made within the data science space and felt like the right opportunity to be able to be part of an industry where you can come in and be a part of transforming the industry as well. So I'm very excited about here. Northwestern Mutual, again, it's a 160 year old legacy company, but has definitely, you know, I've been here for two years and I'm every day amazed by the intensity by which there's a, a re-energized focus on how we implement data science across all of the work streams within NM. And Mark, you have seen firsthand for the last two years and you have seen the transformation. Yeah, uh, I came in just before you and uh, it's been uh, there's been a lot of talk about passion today. And I feel like we have that passion at Northwestern Mutual. We were uh, from our financial representatives to our home office. We have lots of people that are very passionate about data, about providing the, the very best results for our clients. And so um, I'm, I'm very grateful to work for someplace where everyone brings their passion every day and we have an incredible culture. Yeah, and to that point, Mark, it'll be great, you know, you and I work together with Jonathan Stark as well around the Northwestern Mutual Data Science Institute. Do you want to give our audience a little bit of sneak peek on NMDSI? Yeah, so I've had the, the privilege of helping uh, build the, the Data Science Institute um, over the last uh, couple of years here. And we've we've had some some great impact over the last five the five initial years. Uh, we have three pillars, uh, and we're trying to make uh, waves in in the in the tech ecosystem here in Milwaukee and regionally. And so one is on research. So I think we already uh, have talked about that. You, you we can't do everything, and so we need to have uh, faculty and students helping with some of the uh, data exploratory work that we can't handle in-house. And so it's really been terrific to leverage uh, uh, faculty and students to do some of that work. So uh, we have a, a research pipeline. We also have a talent pipeline where we're, we've, we've doubled down on, on growing our internships, um, uh, breadth and depth there, uh, and all uh, in, in all kinds of talent in the region, whether it's data science or data engineering and software engineering alike, uh, with new courses and programs at UW-Milwaukee and Marquette. And uh, we, and then 
leveraging like opportunities like this. Just I really feel privileged to Dustin and 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 Brandy for inviting us today and, and allowing us to contribute to this conversation. And then finally, uh, I have to mention our community pillar. There's some really great nonprofits in Milwaukee that are doing great data work uh, for each other. Uh, the data you can use team, huge shout out to them. Uh, we have project-based learning experiences happening with capstones at UW-Milwaukee and Marquette. And we have a, a monthly speaker series. So uh, I'll throw it in the chat when I'm done, uh, but uh, follow us at uh, nmdsi.org. And we'd love to, to have more folks get involved with building uh, this ecosystem. So uh, same question back to you, Anju. Those were my highlights of the last five years of helping with the NMDSI. What have been your biggest accomplishments in data science and analytics at Northwestern Mutual over the last two years you've been here? Yeah, yeah. And the way I would answer this, there's a question in the chat coming up around what are the top use cases of ML? So we use machine learning at a fairly high intensity without and within NM for the last two years. And some of the use cases at high level is around underwriting. I talked about that earlier. And then fraud detection is definitely we are using it as well. Uh, predicting propensity scores for different risk products that we are selling in the marketplace, that's definitely a use case for us. And then also understanding what is our product roadmap and how do we really paint the picture of the product roadmap from a strategy perspective. And then um, fraud detection, I mentioned earlier already. We are also looking at you know, forecasting mechanism. How can we forecast better on the client services side, on the call center side? So that's been, um, that's been one of the key interest areas for us. And the next best action, which you'll definitely, uh, if you don't know about it, I would definitely encourage you to read a lot more about next best action, especially as it comes to not only the insurance industry, but all the other verticals as well. And next best action is essentially deriving the insights given all the historical data that we have. How do we derive insights on what the FR is wanting to go after, what the client is wanting to go after? When I talk about the use case, the end goal always is provide a seamless client experience to the, uh, to the clients. And the way we work and deliver these use cases, which if you are in a data science career, which I have always been, I would highly encourage you to have a greater understanding of the business as you are driving any project that you are driving, get to know what your business wants, spend a lot more time with the business users. And when I think about how we have structured the team, even for data science internally within NM, our our data science teams are heavily embedded with our business teams. We constantly iterate with them on the report out cycles. PI report out is what we call. And we learn from them. So it's a, it's always a translation between what we deliver, which is, or how we think about solutions. It's highly complex always. So we have to simplify it and do a translation with the business to also understand what they are trying to go after. So there is a convergence of sciences that are starting to happen a lot more than what it used to happen in, um, when I was growing up in the data science career. So I would highly encourage all of you to really focus on convergence of sciences as well as you're building your career within the data science space. Yeah, we're gonna run short on time. I don't see Dustin coming in. Let me, because Anja, you hit on a couple of things that I want to make sure that we leave with the audience as they think about uh, applying for roles at Northwestern Mutual or otherwise. Anju hit on be client focused, client focused, know your why, know how to deliver on the objective, connect the dots. There's a lot, you can have lots of different roles in this space, but whether you're an analyst or engineer, help, help each other and help uh, your other peers on these teams connect the dots. And uh, it's been mentioned already today, be courageous, uh, be ready to fail uh, and, and get in there and build, get messy uh, and then uh, learn and grow as you go.